The Last Stop by Zoe Rosenberg. I was eating yummy succotash when my mom looked down and saw me head in hand with my bowl full of soup. What's wrong? She asked, worried. I wish I had more toys, I said sadly. My mom said she had a doll I could borrow. Do be careful, she said cautiously. I had this when I was little. I took the doll outside. It had a strong nut head, a tea straw for arms and legs, and an up and a juicy upside down strawberry for a dress. Soon I found a clear body of water flowing down the green grass. All of a sudden, plop, I stared shocked as it all fell free. I could feel my eyes getting wet, but I didn't cry. All of a sudden, I found myself running breathlessly back home. When my mother saw me, she asked what had happened. I gulped. Then blurted out as scared as someone who lost their homework. A deer came running toward me and I dropped the doll. My mom <laughs> 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 My mom looked quite confused. Maybe I said it too fast. Uh, she shook her head sadly sighed and walked away. A few weeks later I came to the fish trap that smelled like that smell like salt, then saw a stroll hanging out. Oh no, I had no choice. I quickly grabbed the doll, wondering what would happen next. My mom was right behind me. She did not look happy. I took a deep, shaky breath and told the truth. My mom looked down at me. Mom looked as if I was growing a tail. <laughs> What about the deer that scared you? She asked. I couldn't, I couldn't stand it. I heard a scared voice saying, I'm off to the turtle clam. It took a split second to realize it was my voice. <laughs> And that was when I heard mom yelling, I believe you, I'm not mad. Phew, it's okay, she said, but next time, tell the truth, okay? Okay, I said, 